In this video, we will discuss an example of how to solve the linear equation using matrices. Alright, so for this example, okay, so given the matrix A with the element 1, 5, 1, 3, negative 1, 3, negative 9, 3, 7, and matrix B with element 1, 2, negative 1, 3, negative 1, 0, 0, 3, 1. Alright, so the question is, first is to find A times B and then find a inverse right so that's it that is the first part of the question the second part of the question is hence solve the following linear equation all right so first we do the first part of the question first which is find a times b all right so so a times b is just a times b is just a matrix a times the matrix b okay this is matrix a time matrix b okay so we just multiply this so by now i think you know how to do this multiplication so we directly write the answer which is 16 0 0 0 16 0 0 0 16 so we, we're going to get this matrix when we multiply a and b but in your exam you must show how do you get this so this is just for the sake of this video i skip the intermediate step all right so we know that a times b is equals to 16 0 0 0 16 0 0 0 16 or oh, this is equals to 16i all right so that is a times b the second part of the question is we need to find a inverse since we know that a times b is equals to 16i so we can use properties okay we can use properties so we know that a inverse is 1 over 16 times b so this is by by properties all right so a inverse is equals to 1 over 16 times b so b is 1 2 negative 1 3 negative 1 0 0 3 1 all right so multiply we're going to get 1 over 16 1 over 8 negative 1 over 16 3 over 16 negative 1 over 16 0 0 3 over 16 and 1 over 16 so this is a inverse all right so this is the first part of the question which is we find a times b and also we find a inverse so second part of the question is hence to solve the following linear equation so hence we need to solve this equation we have question is x plus 5y plus z equals to 7 and then we have 3 x minus y plus 3z equals to 5 and the third equation is negative 9x plus 3y plus 7z equals to 1 all right so this is a three linear equation that we need to solve all right so first step is to form the matrix equation ax equals to b all right so so the first one is 1 5 1 the second one is 3 negative 1 3 and the third one is negative 9 3 7 times x which is x y z is equals to matrix b which is the constant at the right hand side which is 7 5 1 so this is matrix equation and then you will realize that this matrix here is actually the same with the matrix a okay matrix a here okay 1 5 1 3 negative 1 3 negative 9 3 7 so a here is the same with the a at the previous question all right all right so to solve this we need a inverse the second step we need a inverse so since we already know the a inverse from the previous part of the question so we just use that inverse we don't have to do adjoint method to find the inverse we just use the inverse that we already have all right so we know the a inverse is 1 over 16 1 2 negative 1 3 negative 1 0 
zero three one all right so i separate the constant because it's much easier to multiply later right so this is a inverse so that's me we can directly go to the third step which is we're going to solve the equation using the formula so the formula is x is equals to a inverse times b so x is equals to a inverse which is 1 over 16 1 2 negative 1 3 negative 1 0 0 3 1 times b and b is 7 5 1 all right so we just multiply this so we get 1 over 16 outside here so we can multiply this first we have 7 plus 10 minus 1 the third one is 21 minus 5 plus 0 the third one is 0 plus 15 plus 1 and if we simplify this we get 16 16 16 and then we multiply with the constant 1 over 16. So we have 1, 1, 1. So that's mean x is equals to 1, 1, 1. Or this is x, y, z. So that's mean we already solved the equation. So we know that x is equals to 1, y is equals to 1, and z is equals to 1. So we solved the equation.